Hello, uh, welcome to Valiant Hearts, The Great War. I've had this, I've had this a good few years now, but I just, it, it, when I first played it, it didn't work properly, I don't think. But now it's been out for a while, I think it's, uh, it's about time that we did it. Because this, this game, this game will get you, it really will. It's an emotional roller coaster, and all of it. It's yeah, it's a really good story. Excellent music all the way through it. Well worth following, I should say. That's why I gave a bit of an introduction, I think, because I think it's worth it. So let's uh, let's get on with it, shall we? And um, enjoy. Well, well, yeah, quick then. Let's go. August 1st, 1914. After the assassination of Prince Franz Ferdinand of the Austro-Hungarian Empire, the German Empire declares war on Russia. Because of established alliances, France is preparing for conflict. A few hours after the announcement of the general mobilization, German civilians living in France are asked to leave the country. Karl is one of them. days after Carl was deported, the war was hungry for more and took away a meal as well. A heavy-hearted meal was called up to fight and left the farm for Samuel. Like so many others, he had no idea what fate had in store for him. Typical order. My turn. Well, I've been here before. Oh, here we go, here we go. Can't I leave? Oh, okay, okay. Let's get it over and done with, shall we? Yeah, yeah, right, I'm in. Well, that was quick. I haven't got flat feet. Oh dear. Can well be you. Right, hello. Can well be you. So, so the Lord. Yeah, training. Here we go. Oh, I've done this for a while. Right, here we go. Sacre bleu. La grenade. Oh, what a shot. Impressive. 
This game is all on keyboard. All on keyboard. So I'm doing this all on one hand, by the way. Doing this left handed. Oh, something shiny. I'm going to that first. Okay, gentlemen. Try colour. Of the 150th. to Paris. The atmosphere here is strangely cheerful. Now I hope that the harvest goes well. Rely on our neighbours for help. They've always been gracious and charitable people. I'll write again as soon as I get my assignment. Please kiss my little grandson for me. At the train depot in Paris, trying to reach his regiment at Platform 21, Emile would meet the man he would soon fight alongside. The man who would come to be his truest friend. All well, I can see is somebody being bullied by the looks of it. Wait, what's going on? They're throwing apples at me. Have some steam. Right, training is over. Mobilisation. Uh, I'll have that. Cheers. I'll just do these puzzles a bit quick. <laughs> just plough plow through this bit. Uh, hey, here we go. There's a secret there. There's a secret. Got it. We go through all these bits and pieces when, when I get five minutes. So he won't let me at the ladder, but he does like music, and there's a band handily right there. Something shiny up on top of the up, up on top of the uh, train there. So I think uh, let's go. Right there, Francois. Let's go. Yep. Yep. Whoop. One, two, three, four. Here we go. Okay. One more to get dancing, I think. One more. Off we go. Let's get this shiny thing. Shiny things take precedent over everything, but well. Okay, we've got to rescue our friend, haven't we? Well, he's not our friend at the moment. All we saw was somebody being bullied, a big stranger. Not anymore. A new friend, he's called Freddy. He's called Freddy, and he's from the USA. August 21st, 1914. Emil's regiment was sent to fight against the 71st German Division, led by Baron von Dorf. The general cheer of the first hours dissipated into the fear of first combat. Oh, wow. Here we go. Right. Gentlemen. Team La France. Oh no. Oh wow.
need to charge. More machine guns. Oh, oh. <laughs> God, we're through, we're through. Uh, are we on our own? No, we've still got more, come on. Miss Marie Chaillon, Private Emile Chaillon, from the 150th Infantry Regiment, was wounded by enemy fire on August 21st. He has been captured by the enemy. Hopefully, you shall receive news from him soon. Phew. Freddy, originally from America, enlisted voluntarily in the French forces at the start of the war. Behind his bravery hid a man already devastated by the war's effects. A man with one sole obsession. Punish those who had destroyed his life. Okay. It was at the Battle of the Marne that Freddy finally picked up the trail of the regiment commanded by Baron von Hof. Right, we are now Freddy. We were wounded. What have you got? Emil is wounded. Now we're Freddy. Oh, so off the head. Off the head, yank. Oh no, he's got. What am I saying? He's got, he's got, a, he's got a, that's a confederate, that's sure. Oh, he's got a confederate. Oh, I didn't pick up that, that secret there. Oh, what? Oh, well. I saw that something shiny on the ground, I should have done it, but no worries. Freddy don't care, he's gone. Let's go. Wow. Gotta try and land a grenade on the top of there, haven't we? No. Stay out of the way of that machine gun. No. Yes. I think we got it. Yes. Time to move. Distract this guy. Put down the grenade. Put the brick. Okay. Oh, some more dynamite. No, it's not fixed. It is now. Oh. Ah. <laughs> oh yes. Let's go. Okay, we've got to take that. Get get another grenade. We've got to keep. You can only carry one grenade. 
at the moment. I, I, I guess. I don't know anything about this. I just, I just uh, started it up. Thought this is, this is running really nice now. Right, right. Where were we? Let's go. We've got to move while he's fixing his machine gun. Let's go, go, go. Oh, that was close. Got to get rid of him. Got a grenade just in case. Oh. Another machine gun. I've got the grenade on me. Actually, I want to see what he does when I throw the grenade. See if he moves, see if, he, if he's not silly. Right. They're not silly. Right. Good to know. But, but you've got to expect this though, haven't you? <laughs> but I did see something shiny. A doily. That wasn't shiny. Two more guards. Bring the bell. Quickly. Gone. 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 Thanks to support from British forces, the German plan failed. The front line moved back to the north and with the arrival of winter, froze. Soldiers holed up amid a vast labyrinth of trenches and tunnels that would become the indelible image of the Great War. Carl's regiment retreated to the outskirts of Neuve Chapelle, the same camp where Emil was being held prisoner. Yeah, looking Molotov stood there. Looks like it. Hello, hello. So what are we doing here? What are we doing here? Now let's have a look at some of this. Six million. We got all these facts here that we got. We got building up. No Chappelle, Gamo rifles. Wow. That was the Sikhs. Because obviously the Commonwealth, huge. From the British side, and obviously the French side. Their, uh, well, the people that they could pull upon was phenomenal, wasn't it? Okay, he's in the way here. Hey! What do we need? Interhunk Mellet. Interhunk Mellet, which is obviously the dog needs some water. I learnt something today. Now, what have we got? We've got a cook. So, we are the cook. Obviously, with the spatula in our hand. The ladle, so, sorry. 
A picture. That was a secret. Okay. Oh. You mean? Dearest Papa, we live in a climate of uncertainty. Germans use the people of Saint Miel as human shields against the French bombings. I hope the Germans treat you well and that your wound has healed. Your grandson sends you kisses. I sent you a picture of him. All my love. Please write soon. <laughs> wow. Adieu, Carl. All right, all right. I'll get it ready. I'm doing it now. Mon ami. Right, what's the sequence? Water. All right. Fire. He loves sausages. And sausages. <laughs> yeah, here. Whoa. British, British on the way. Oh, what the? That was, that was lucky. Wow. Was called. Not in the blunder club. Right, not what we're doing now. Okay, we've got the dog. We've got a dog with us. Wow. Has he got a name? What? And now... The dog will help us. Wow, that's so cool. Sibia, Sibia. Oh. Yes. So we've got puzzles. Let's try and complete them as quickly as possible. Use this as a counterweight, I guess. Let's do it. What is that? Is that artillery? Whoa. But we're going to call the dog. That's important. Dig there. We can't get through there, so down we go. Dog seems to be able to get through those holes. He's trying to tell us something. Alright, okay. Alright, he's looking for something. 
Allez. Ah ah. Allez, oui. Oh, <laughs> He collects his bone. Got to get his bone. Good boy. Oh well, we don't know, do we? That was to a secret, okay. Let's go. He's telling us, isn't he? He's saying. Come back here, come back here. Yeah. Oh dear. What has he seen? Sausages? No. Come what? back okay. here. Oh! Uh, what are you doing? Oh my god. Oh, great. The British troops continued their attack on Neuve Chapelle. Their next objective? Take back Port Arthur. Freddy. You Here we go. Right, Freddy. Seats. I'm on it, I'm on it. Got some bullets, quick, move! Oh. Oh. Okay, what's he saying? Making a mine, are we? Was that two? What's a two? Let's go. A three and a two. We got to move in. A three. They're up here. And then number two. Okay, Ready? Here we go. Hey! <laughs> Let's go! Underneath one of their pillboxes, a new se another secret. Whoa! Oh no! This is happening. Go move! Fire! Ooh! Oh, 
come on. This must be the dog. Yo, yes. Okay, we need to set him free as well. I think the adventure starts, I think. Merci, I think here we go. The two of us. Or the three of us. We've got to save. And get rid of the boss. Let's do it, shall we? Amidst the never-ending attacks and counter-attacks, Freddy and Emil hunted the elusive Baron and his regiment in Ypres. And that'll be the next time. Cheers.